Hello and welcome to Monday's Daily Financial Review. Here's what's making the headlines in the markets today. The dollar-yen pair has fallen 0.3% in the last two sessions. The ATR has gradually receded into the low volatility area. The euro-dollar pair has gained 0.3% in the last session. The MACD has entered the positive zone. The Aussie dollar pair has gained 0.8% in the last three sessions. The stochastic RSI has transitioned sharply into the overbought area. The price of crude oil has gained 13.8% in the last three sessions. The highs-lows indicator is receding into the neutral area. Those were today's major economic events. And now, moving on to world financial headlines. One of Trump's advisors warns that the shuttering of the U.S. economy due to the coronavirus pandemic could push the national unemployment rate to 16 percent. The prospect of a severe economic contraction and the Eurozone's slow and complex decision-making process will likely pressure the Euro-dollar pair. The passing week revealed the magnitude of how damaged the energy industry is, and analysts are expecting more turmoil down the road. And now, let's hear what our chief analyst picked up for us today. The U.S. Dallas Fed Manufacturing Business Index will be released at 1530 GMT. The U.S. three-month bill auction at 1630 GMT. France's jobless claims at 1000 GMT. Brazil's consumer confidence will be released at 1100 GMT. The Russian unemployment rate at 1300 GMT. And Hong Kong's trade balance at 830 GMT. We hope that you've enjoyed Monday's financial review. On behalf of all of us here, we wish you a productive trading day. Be sure to join us tomorrow morning for the latest news and events from the financial markets.